guys welcome back to the channel and in this video I'm gonna show you how to resolve the missing static files problem in Django admin panel so right now you can see I have this uh, debug as true so our admin panel is uh, working fine with the CSS so now as soon as I change this to uh, debug as false and add this asterisk at uh, allowed host you can see our CSS is no more working and we have this ugly looking Django admin login form so and if we press our uh, this F12 key or just visit our uh, inspector we will just copy this our base.css and just manually visit this file so we can see we don't have access to this it is saying not found we don't have any base.css file right here so to overcome this problem we have to install a module called white noise so i will uh, stop this server from running and i will run this command pip install white noise so if you have ever used heroku you will see heroku also uses white noise uh, for this static file management so we are using the same and now i will uh, clear the terminal and then we have to add it our settings.py file a bit so the first thing we have to do is we have to add our middleware here yeah so i have added this middleware this white noise middleware here and then after that we have to add a, a static root and some other configurations here yeah so i have added this static root and static files storage here now if um, if we run the server again we will see we have a warning here saying no directory at this url uh, this static directory let's just see what we have here so you can see in our uh, workspace we don't have any static directory here so to create that directory we will have to run this command python manage.py collect static and we have 132 static files copied to this static folder so we have that folder right now here now we will run our server again and our server is uh, running fine so if we reload this a uh, login form again we can see our css is back and if we copy this uh, url again and we visit it we will see we have our uh, css here also you can see by default we don't have any random characters here between base and css but uh, after adding white noise we have some random characters here so these are some things that a uh, white noise does for us and now our css is working fine so i hope this tutorial is helpful for you guys so i will catch you in the next one